Over the packed parking lot at the North Concord BART station, every space is taken. But what if the lot were to disappear to make way for development? KPIX 5's Melissa Kane says it could happen, and she's live at the station on Port Chicago Highway. Melissa? Yeah, Liz, the fate of this enormous parking lot at the North Concord BART station is in the balance tonight as the BART Board of Directors votes to put this whole thing in with a development across the street. I live in Pleasant Hill, so it's really kind of easy and convenient from my home, um, and I commute into Oakland every day. 1,977 parking spaces, and still, the parking lot at the North Concord BART station was overflowing today, same as every day. Yeah, they park, they park over, you know, so partly so they don't have to pay for parking and partly, you know, because this is one way in, one way out. So, you know, it's uh, gets a little backed up. Just across the street is 5,000 acres of land owned by the Navy. The city of Concord wants to develop that land, and tonight, BART is voting to join that development. Guy Bjerke is the director of the project for the city of Concord. There's an agreement between the city uh, and the BART board that's before the BART board uh, this evening that basically just sets the broad terms for including BART's 18 acres uh, in the planning for the specific plan. Doug Tegner isn't sold. What? That that land over there is the city of Concord. This is BART. I don't I don't understand the correlation between the two. Once the land is part of the development, what happens to all this parking? Deborah Allen is a member of the BART board of directors. Our own uh, TOD transit oriented development policy um, states that we were we are looking to uh, encourage non auto access. Ellen is concerned about what will happen to the nearly 2,000 parking spots here. My uh, early indication from other staff and BART board members is that we would look to diminish them, uh, if not eliminate them, and ask the city of Concord to come up with a solution somewhere close by, but not necessarily next to the station. The people we talked to said if parking is cut back, they won't abandon their cars. Maybe drive to Lafayette. I've heard that. Lafayette you can get into just about any time of day. I'd probably be very frustrated. I'd probably have to think about coming even earlier, um, you know, uh, which I don't want to do. Now, the district that we're in right now, the BART district that we're in, is Joel Keller's district, and we tried repeatedly to get in touch with him today, but he did not respond. Now, the BART board meeting is happening right now, and they're debating a number of issues on their agenda, but we've got cameras in the room, and we will keep you updated. Live in Concord, Melissa Kane, KPIX 5.